Welcome back to Sturge Tropia. This is Sturge playing Nikki Hennessy in RuneScape. And I am going to do the Vault of Shadows mystery in this video. Uh, it's kind of a... I can only do part of it, it's, so it's a, very, it's a pretty complex. Level 107 to complete it. Level 86 to do the second part. I'm, I'm just going to do the first part and the first puzzle and show you what that's all about. Uh, I have uh, already completed the time served... Uh, mystery as well, which is this uh, cell controller behind me. You need an ancient timepiece to activate this particular deal. And this actually opens up the door to get you down below and get you into the area you need to go for the Vault of Shadows mystery. So let's get to it. I'm going to show you how I do it. Once you come in, you're going to want to head to the right and down the stairs to this inactive dial and you're going to cast your incite fear uh, spell you've gotten this scroll from uh, the level above from digging and uh, restoring this which you'll actually need your legatus uh, pendant and your pontifex uh, signet ring to have gotten so you'll need both of those i don't think you need to wear them while you're down here necessarily i would get hurt and you can find out the hard way i suppose but You'll have them anyway. And then uh, here's the puzzle. Come down and let's uh, set some things up here. Let's get set up for this. Okay, you can pick up the Preter's page and read it if you like. Um, but I would rather, I just want to get this all set up here. I'm taking a screenshot. Isn't that nice. Uh, I want to just get this set up. It's going to go pretty fast, so you can pause at any point during the, uh, the video. And uh, But everything will be on screen, so let's get started. You're going to want to come down and face north. And then I'm going to use the codes F for forward, B for backward, north, east, south, west, so on and so forth. So let's do it. Okay, here we go. Uh, you can see uh, it's set up in nine. So we're going to go northeast and we're going to go one forward. And you'll have to, uh, you know, left click it. And then we're going to go east, one forward. And then we're going to go northeast again, one backward. Now we're going to go southwest, one backward. Now we're going to go south, and we're going to go two forward. And going southeast, two forward. And then next up is the center, and we'll go one forward in the center. So that's kind of fast, but uh, it's all on screen, so you don't, have to, you don't have to worry too much there. Next up, north, one backward. South, one backward. West, one forward. And the last one, northwest, one forward. And this will open the door. Yay, look at that. But if you need to, you can go back and get the, get the code, and I'll put it down in the description as well. Look at that, that's pretty cool. All right, and you could study the doorway also to get uh, more research. I always, yeah, that's the, that's the cool. That is the Vault of Shadows. New research available. Wow, isn't that cool? Yeah, I love this stuff. Uh, well, we got, we got it all set up. You can read the Pontifex page two. Or I'm sorry, part of Pre Preter's page too, and get going. Uh, pretty cool stuff. Well, that's uh, that's as far as I can go. We got to be level 86 and in the chapel for the next part and casting spells and so forth up there. But uh, I thought it was kind of cool to get this far. Um, you know, I mean, it's just kind of adds to the uh, the fun I'm having with this archaeology. Hopefully, it doesn't wear out too fast. There's a lot going on in archaeology, but it's uh, yeah, it's super cool. Well. You know how that goes. Uh, new content gets exciting. I appreciate you all watching. And if you have yet to subscribe, please consider subscribing and leaving a comment uh, and or like or a thumbs down if you don't like it down below. Um, thank you all for stopping by. Ciao for now.